So I tried the latest Oxygen OS 15, which is just in beta right now while making this video and it's based on Android 15. I also used Oxygen OS 14, so I know some of the features there and yes, with Oxygen OS 15, we have some major changes and some of my favorite includes these. First one is a lock screen. Lock, screens, lock screen have some major changes here. As you can see, we have some themes called flux themes. These are pre-installed, already available. So for example, I just applied this theme on my device on a lock screen. As you can see, this is how it is looking like. Personally speaking, it's looking quite good. And it's just not like that. If you click on more themes and move on to some other options, there are many other options available for you. So for example, if we try to apply this pulse and here you can see it's similar to some of the other OEMs right now, maybe with one UI, even with hyper OS and similar thing with iOS too. You can customize a lot of things here. You can customize the clock style. You can customize the fonts. You can customize a lot of extra things. So in the terms of lock screen customizations, as far as I know, many OEMs are adapting lock screen customizations, which is not bad, of course. If you take a look at this home screen customizations, it's good, actually. This thing is actually inspired from iOS, to be honest. I tried it, I'm using it. Maybe it's available in some other OEMs too, but for now, this is what we have with Oxygen OS 15. And personally speaking, I just love this thing because it's good. You have the potential to customize these things. This is not a bad deal at all. As you can see, this is how the output is looking good. And you can customize a lot of things after applying this thing on a device. You have a lot of lock screen customizations. So it's totally up to you if you are into customizations or not. Secondly, the change which you will find here is in the quick settings panel. The quick settings panel is also changed and it also has a swipe gesture. Unfortunately, it's missing from iOS in, in my personal opinion. I love this thing, but it's not available there. But Oxygen OS actually implemented it very good. This is the quick settings panel what you have, but it's not even enabled by default. I mean, it's there, but you have the option to choose. It's not only one available there. We have option available for you. So this is another one which you have called as classic style, but you also have the split style available. And even you can customize the tile shape. So yes, in the terms of features, in the terms of customizations, Oxygen OS is now actually doing a very good job. As you can see, split settings or split quick settings panel is looking like this one. So you can also switch between the notification drawer and the, and the quick settings panel. By swiping down from the left side, you will see the notification panel or swiping down from the right side, you will see the quick settings panel. So yes, the gestures are also looking quite good. Another thing which is actually so, so good what I found in this one is share with iPhone. I tried this yesterday and it was just so good. After clicking on share with iPhone, so I tried sharing some files from my iPhone 16 Pro to this one. And yes, this was looking good. This was looking quite amazing. And yes, uh, the speed was uh, so good. I tried copying a file. I tried sending a file of around 8 gigabytes from iPhone to Android to this OnePlus to this Oxygen OS 15. It took me around four to five minutes and sending or transferring eight GB file. It's not bad. I mean, for four or five, uh, four or five minutes speed, it was good. And as you can see, this is how the output is looking like. So you just notice that dynamic pill or dynamic island. And yes, it's all also implemented with Oxygen OS 15 in some other apps too. For example, this is the recorder app, but we have right now also, I tried using some timer here in the clock app. Let me show you by clicking on this one, by applying this. And after entering like this, as you can see, we have the dynamic island implemented. And this looks amazing too. Yes, they actually copied a lot of things, but yes, not bad. I mean, it's good. Things are looking not bad. And as you can see, we have this, these kind of options available. These are not only the ones we have support for Swiggy and Zomato as far as I know, or maybe with Uber Eats and some more apps. Not so sure, but for now, these are the things that we have right now. So these are some amazing features or uh, actually one of, or some of my favorite ones you can say, but we already have a lot of extra changes available with many things. Even the about phone section is now changed. Uh, some of the changes are implemented here and some more things here and there. When you use this Oxygen OS 15 on your device, you might notice some of the things. And if, in case if you are wondering which device I'm using, I'm using Poco F5 and this is a ported edition. Just wanted to install it to show you how Oxygen OS is looking like. So thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.